Hey, down here. Okay, that blank screen there is fixing to be the AS Rock booting up. And uh, going to do <coughs> just my hands switched over here. We're going to use the keyboard. Going to use easy to boot. That's my plan here. Uh, on my SD card and the USB adapter to install. Let's see. Windows boot. Windows install. Okay. Um, I checked my vir uh, viruses. My uh, checked my uh, license key for this one, and uh, I had. Um, okay, now I have seven Windows installers in here. Seven. A Windows seven five. Yeah, I thought what. Okay, so I checked my key. And what I have on what this system, what the license key is for, is I have I had three different uh, versions of Windows 7 Professional already on here, but what it is is Windows Home Premium. And uh, I, I have the 64-bit uh, and the x86 ISOs, um, <coughs> which I downloaded from the Microsoft site, and uh, they have a, it's not a Microsoft.com site, but it's Evidently, supposedly run by them anyway, and uh, I can't remember the name of it or anything. But uh, if, you, if you're looking for them, just start searching for, you know, Windows 7 ISO or whatever, and you kind of try to ignore all the crap and find your way to the one that says it's free and legal. That's how I found it. And uh, make sure that that's not a lie too, because <laughs> there's you know how it is when you're looking for that kind of stuff. So anyway. Let's boot this up, hopefully, and uh, as long as you have your license key, let's see, <coughs> it's just sitting there. Okay, I'm going to have to choose something, zero through four. Okay, use easy to boot. I can't see the numbers on the left, but because of the way it, it didn't fit the screen just right, but... Uh, First one was would be zero easy to boot XML file full language UI XML load ISO no prompt to repair sample XML one seven pro auto wipe disk no we don't want that so I'm just gonna say zero because I don't know full language well I don't need to change languages and. Uh, I don't want it to go into repair. I need to install. So I want O. Where's O? Can't see where my phone doesn't hold it still. Okay. Error. Okay. Too many fragments. I already ran that defrag program. Huh. Okay, now what? I will try something else here. Um, I went straight in there. It didn't go and let me. Okay. I'll do number one this time. Maybe choosing a language will help. I don't know. I haven't ever tried this ISO before. Um, you know, it could even be a bad ISO for all I know. Please wait. At least if I tried it, I don't remember. The others booted just fine, though, the Windows 7 Pro, so that's what I'm thinking. Hmm. Too many fragments. <coughs> Try it one more time. I'm going to try number three. Sample XML. Well, no, I'll try number four. Because uh, I'm not, like I said, I don't want to repair, I want to install. So, number four. I don't think it's going to work at all, no matter what I select. So, I'm going to go to the next one, uh, x86. That would be the 32 bit version. Just doing that again. 
Add a zero again. I see that one's loading. Okay. Oh, that was a 32 bit, wasn't it? I was thinking ahead of what I might do next, and, and I forgot what I just did. Maybe that, oh, the real problem is that that uh, ISO won't run on this machine. It should. Well, with the processor, yeah, the processor. I need to check out what the processor is. Make sure it's a 64 bit processor before I decide I have a bad ISO or anything. Because this looks like it's running just like it should so far. <coughs> I wonder if this will tell me in here. I don't really remember anything that would do that. Okay. Found. Recovery environment. R-E-C-E-N-B -E -E dot E-X-E -E. Repair, Recover and N, Install Windows Okay So Looking back up and make sure I didn't skip anything important Oh, press enter or end to install Windows. Okay, let's just see what... It, I don't think it gives you a report of what your processor is or any of that stuff before it starts. I'll probably have to go into Part of Magic. But, uh... I don't really want to do Next in this case because... That would... That it w I would hit Next if I want... But I want to do the 64-bit if I can. I gotta make sure whether or not this machine is, uh... I probably have some hardware reports on my other on my regular somewhere that I saved from the past, or I can just boot to Party Magic. Let's see if I can hit. I'll stop this video and figure all that out and come back. All right, bye.